Fans want to know, will there ever be a Steven Seagal, John claude Van Damme movie? We ask Philippe Martinez, who's directed General Commander with Steven Seagal and Wake of Death with John claude Van Damme to see if these two would ever finally go head to head on the big screen. You're the only one in the world who's directed both Seagal and Van Damme movies. Now, you would know, will there ever be a Seagal, John claude Van Damme movie? Listen, like you said, I, I'm, I'm the, I think I'm the only guy that has directed both. I directed Jean-Claude uh, in uh, Wake of Death, uh, where he did a terrific performance. Uh, it's a good movie. And I directed uh, Steven, uh, the last movie that he shot, which is General Commander. Uh, so, did I try to make a movie with the two of them, like a lot of people before me? Yes. Recently, again, I was speaking a few months ago to Jean-Claude about it. Jean-Claude was not opposed to it, uh, to be honest. Steven was much more uh, distant to, uh, to the idea. I really don't think it will happen because... <sighs> You know, I think there's been a little bit of bad blood between them, like a competition of for the last 25 years. Things have been said. You know, they almost went to hand uh, at some point in Stallone's house. Um, so I think that the task to put the two of them together in a movie is impossible. I tried a few months ago, to be honest with you, and I spoke to both of them about it, but it just... Um, it just, uh, I don't think it's ever going to happen, no. Oh, man. Either way, it's obvious the, the public <laughs> wants to see these two titans battle it out. Uh, but, uh, but Philippe, you would know best. Who do you think would win in a fight? Why do you put me in the middle of this shit? You know, <laughs> I mean, you know. Listen, I, I know both of them, okay? Uh, and, and I like both of them. I like their family. You know, Jean-Claude has a wonderful, has wonderful parents, his mother, his father, kids, wife, uh, Stephen, wonderful wife, wonderful kids. You know, so it's difficult to put me in the middle. But, you know, as a director, I've also seen them as artists. OK, totally different. No question. Stephen is very much into minimalism. Uh, Jean-Claude is much more uh, open. But when it comes to actually fight, you know, don't forget that this is a movie. You know, Steven, uh, I think, is uh, what the, the, the highest uh, uh, belt or, or, or grade uh, in Aikido. Steven is a professional fighter that became an actor. Uh, Jean-Claude, it's different. He's not a professional fighter that became an actor. You know, I saw, I saw him doing an act in Cannes one year where he said that he was going to go in the ring and fight a guy. And I, told, I put him aside. I said, Jean-Claude, the fuck are you doing? You know, <laughs> you're going to get your ass kicked. So, I mean, it would be an interesting fight. You know, I would be interested to know if, uh, if, uh, if uh, you know, I... I actually saw that tweet uh, yesterday, and I was on the phone with Steven, and, uh, and I said, listen, there is a, apparently Jean-Claude said that he would kick your ass. I said, you know, do you want, do you want to make like a, like a fight, like we promote a fight, like maybe in Rome, like the city of the gladiator in Rome, you against Jean-Claude, you know, three rounds, you know, let's make it happen. And <laughs> Steven said, brother, the man will never show up. He knows that, he knows that, and you know that. So, you know, but, you know, it will be funny to see if the fan, because look, those guys are getting old, okay? So, and this is this bullshit about uh, who is stronger, uh, Van Damme or Segal has been gone for 25, 30 years now. You know, so before they die and get to the cemetery, It'd be nice to know, you know, to have like a big and make it very cinematic, like, you know, like uh, in Rome, you know, making like a gladiator type of fight, the two of them. You know, it'd be nice to have a poll, to run a poll to see uh, 
Uh, but you know, like something well organized, of course. It'd be nice to see if uh, the fan would like to see that or not, because the movie is never going to happen, that's for sure. But three round to settle the, the debate once forever after 25 years, why not? You know? But Jean Claude will never do it, because you see, the problem is that he might be able to hurt Steven with a couple of kick or whatever, but Steven with his hand is brutal. You know, he's very strong. And, uh, you know, if he puts his hand on Jean-Claude, yeah, uh, no. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> Let's face it, you know. Uh, you know, uh, Jean-Claude is uh, doing great movies right now. He's doing, uh, I, I, his movie Lucas is doing well. Uh, he, the movie that he does in Europe are really good. JCVD is very good. Lucas is very good movie. You know, Jean-Claude is more an actor. Steven is more a real fighter. So, no, Jean-Claude will never agree, and uh, to, to go uh, <laughs> against Steven, even for three rounds, never, never in a million years. Oh, my God, you heard it here first, people, straight from the man himself. He would know, he directed both men in movies. Listen, oh. it's not, an, uh, listen, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not insulting Jean-Claude, like I say, I, you know, I like Jean-Claude, he's a nice guy, you know, he's, he's all over the place sometimes, but... And, and on Wake Up Death, he really worked very hard. And I, and I, and I saw uh, uh, his movie, uh, The Bouncer, Lucas, in France. Really good movie, you know. But, you know, uh, there is a difference between a fighter and real fight. And uh, that's why, you know, when they say those things, you know, I would kick Steven Segal ass. You know, you say that on the radio or whatever, on an interview or... Uh, you know, the other day I know that he saw that Stephen was fat. Uh, you know, you know, you gotta have some respect. You know, uh, but that's uh, that's the world of those guys. You know, they like to uh, to. Stephen is not like that. I must say, Stephen just doesn't talk about Van Damme. He's like, for him, it's kind of that Van Damme doesn't even exist in his world. You know, so that's why he told me, brother, the man will never show. You know that. <laughs> And I know that. <laughs> La Best Measure asks, John claude Van Damme has recently stated that he believes that uh, he would, and I quote, wreck Steven Seagal in a battle of martial arts. You've, what is your response to that, to all these allegations that Van Damme can just whip Steven Seagal's ass? First of all, okay, I think that, uh, uh, I, I have, you know, that someone saying that Jean-Claude said that, Okay, yeah. Jean Claude yeah. might have never said that. Okay, That's true. because Jean Claude knows better that he couldn't wreck. <laughs> All right, we got one more, one more question. Listen, from I'm, I'm not being, you know, I'm not, I'm not being uh, disrespectful. That's a fact. You know, one is a very dangerous fighter, and the other one is, uh, you know, uh, an actor. But uh, you know, he moves the, f the the foot. He knows a few moves. You know, he's in perfect shape. No, no, no doubt about that. He's probably in a much better shape than Steven. That's no doubt about that. And he can throw the kick wonderfully. That's more like a dancing thing. That's not really like, you know, hardcore fighting. You heard it here, folks. You heard it here, <laughs> folks. Please leave any uh, questions or comments. What do you think? Who might win in a fight between Steven Seagal and Jean-Claude Van Damme in the comments? To watch the full interview, visit 365flicks.com and cast your vote on who would win in a three-round fight between Jean-Claude Van Damme and Steven Seagal.